Besides on air, on location at Snow Globe 2019, we're here with one of the amazing performers, Ka Lo. Hi. Welcome to South doing? Lake Tahoe. Thank you. <laughs> uh, we were just chatting off camera about your preparation. You came from Nigeria. Yeah. Right here. I was on holiday. Yeah. How yeah. were your holidays? It was great. What is the holidays like in Nigeria, in your home? A lot of drinking. A lot of drinking. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Crazy family? But it is, no, it's just great. Most of my friends are there, so I just ah, spaz out yeah. after not seeing them for so long. Mm. So. Yeah, it's been a great year for you. Yeah. You haven't seen your friends because you're yeah. traveling and doing things. Yeah. I, I want to touch on it. You, you started the year off playing Coachella. Oh, it was a little cameo. little cameo with <laughs> yeah. Idris Elba. This is Idris Elba. Yeah, no, no big, big deal. deal. Yeah. You have a song with him. <laughs> yeah. And, well, how did that song come about? I have no clue because I was watching him on SNL and I was like, whoa, Idris Elba's on SNL, this is cool. And that was like the first time I've ever mentioned Idris Elba on my socials ever. I usually keep my lust private. And then um, like a few days later, someone reached out to me and was like, oh, Idris Elba would like to do a track with you. I'm like, this is, this is a scam. Yeah. I thought it was a scam, but it wasn't. I was like, oh, here we are. So what was that Coachella experience like? Because everybody has their own moment. Yeah. Not only as a performer, but just to be in that environment, right? Oh yeah, it was It was also my first time there at all. So I was like, whoa, it's pretty. But then I had a lot of like Unique played, LPGOB played a little, and um, my friend Mr. Easy played, and then Idris Elba played. So it was like, I didn't even get, really get to see the acts I actually wanted to see because I was just, <laughs> going around supporting all my friends. It was pretty great. Up till now, you've had a lot of collaborations and yeah. you know, Riton was the big one with the Grammy yeah. nomination and things like that. Yeah. But that was four years ago. Now you're yeah. on your own. You got Exit Sign, yeah. your debut single. I find that yeah. fascinating because four years later, now you're coming out with your own stuff. Yeah, it's like, it's, it's actually three. Oh, three. <laughs> this is the third year. Yes. Of, so it just felt like the right time because it's like, I've been just all the time, it's just been collabs, 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 and I was just like, I just want to do my own thing. So I started my own label as well, and just like fully just went, you know, I don't know, there's a saying for it that I can't think of right now. Like, just to, that was the moment and yeah. you seize the opportunity. Yeah, exactly. So next year, which is in two days or 48 hours, right? <laughs> there's going to be a lot of exciting stuff like coming out, like from just me. Yeah. And still some collabs, but mainly yeah. just me. We're on the cusp of the 20s, and so, like you just said, right? Yeah, it's uh, a new decade. Do you make resolutions? Are you the type to say, all right? Yeah, I have like a little goal list I make at the end of every year, like right before midnight. Or like write a little goal list. Okay. Yeah. Anything that you can share? I haven't written it yet. It's not right before midnight. Oh my God. Yeah. You wait until right before midnight yeah, to stay, I, make what this if, list? Because chances are if it's on my mind and it's that in my brain, then I really want it and yeah. I write it down. Wow. And I'm like, okay, this is what I want to do for the next year. Okay. Yeah. Well, one of my wish lists for you is to actually win that Grammy. Amen, hallelujah, if and the Lord wills it. show people what Inshallah. you can do because I really enjoy your music. Yeah, thank you. Uh, I hope the Recording Academy enjoys it too. <laughs> so album so. sometime for sure in the next year. I'm not sure about album. I'll see it like, cause you know, okay. listeners, All right, no I don't know what they're gonna want. And you know, I'm still at this very fragile state where like a lot of people, they know the songs, but they don't always necessarily know that it's my song. So they're like, oh, I know this song. Like, it, you'll see it, it happens. Like, yeah. they know that, they know, especially in America, they know Fake ID, but they don't know who sings Fake ID. Right. Or when I, when I, like when the beat starts on stage, they're like, ah! <laughs> but they didn't know they knew it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's how it is, right? Yeah. It's always the melody first. Yeah, exactly. So I'm trying to like, you know, like, you know what? I'll make that one of my goals to be more patiently out there. Cause it's a pretty face. It's a. It's, Gorgeous face. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> I'm staring at it. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to not be People stalkerish and creepy face. about it. Yeah. It's a beautiful so, face. We'll see. Congrats yeah. on everything. Happy Thank New you. Year. Wonderful to meet Thank you. you. It is uh, Kyle Lowe. We're at Snow Globe 2019. B-Sides on Air. Yeah. <laughs>